Hello everyone, so for today's vlog, I'm going to talk about the life of Rizal. Jose Protasio Rizal Mercado E. Alonzo Ray Alonda was born in Calamba, Philippines on June 19, 1861. He is a notable and honorable figure in the Philippine history. Jose Rizal was raised in a family of 13. I can connect to this because I also have a big family and my sibling is equally supportive to each of us, especially when we are in need. We have a lot of influences and impact on each other. It is the essence of having a family. We should look out for one another. Even though his family was prominent at the time, Jose Rizal led a humble life. He was always striving to be the greatest at whatever he do. He was like most of us in that he struggled and succeeded in various facets of his life. Jose Rizal's first teacher was his mother. Regarding to his educational achievements, I think I won't be able to have the accomplishments like Jose Rizal had. He really excelled in his academics. However, I think it's okay to not reach so many goals in life. I can simply live my life normally and do nice things. He worked hard to achieve all of these jobs and skills. Despite the many challenges that lie ahead, I believe and am motivated to fulfill of all of my life goals just like Rizal did. The difficulties are lessons and experiences that I should learn from and in order to improve and work harder. Many factors influence Rizal's life during his school years that has opened his mind to depression from the Spaniards which also led him to write his first and second novel, the Noli Metangere and El Filibusterismo, which revealed the dark side of Spain colonialism. I would also want to protect my country and all victims of oppression if I had the ability and power to do. It is so hard to know that there is injustice happening but I cannot do something to change it. I can relate to Rizal's commitment in encouraging others to fight for their rights and justice in the face of the abuse of power and injustice. I'm also eager to encourage others to fight for their rights rather than allowing others who are more powerful in terms of social status to walk all over them simply because they lack the wealth, power, and fame that others have. His bravery cost him his life, but I believe his death significantly impacts the society. It reflects the dignity and honor which he lived his life. He made major sacrifices to the society, which is why we are here today. I also wanted to live my life with such meaning and purpose, and I am still a work in progress in reaching all that is meant for me. I also wanted to live my life without regrets by doing what I love and what would make me happy. Rizal's life is exceptional because he accomplished so much in his lifetime. He is highly regarded as the Philippines' national hero. Through his writing, he fought for the country's independence. His values and postulates had a far-reaching influence on the, Philippine, on the Philippines. Because of his bravery and patriotic efforts, our country has earned freedom. It has had a profound impact on the Philippines and its people.